Hello everyone, let's start with section B and it has some important questions, really important questions in this video. So let's start with the first question of it and we can continue with more questions. So yes, in this question it is given that you have angle BOA, sorry BOA is a diameter of a circle and tangent at point P meets BA when produced at T. If angle PBO is 30 degree, what is the measure of angle PTA? We have to find this angle PTA. But usse pehle aapko kya mention hai? That angle PBO is 30. Or PBO bhi likh sakte ho. Or isko aap PBA bhi likh sakte ho. Kyunki aap dekho agar dhyan se. O and A are in a same straight line. So it can be written as PBO. Or it can be written as PBA. As 30 degree. Then what we can see is that. There is a semicircle. This is a semicircle. BPA. ये semicircle form हो रहा है और angle इन्हें semicircle क्या होता है? 90 degree. I can write that BPA is 90 degree. In bracket I can write angle इन्हें semicircle. Then you can see कि radius और tangent के बीच में हमेशा कैसा angle बनता है? 90 degree. जैसे you can see OPT यहाँ पे. OPT भी 90 degree form होगा. Q 90 degree form होगा because OP is a radius. And PT is a tangent. So yes, you can write ki OP, OPT is 90 degree. Why? You can write ki angle between radius and tangent is 90. They are perpendicular to each other. Then you can see ki hamare pas triangle BPA hai. Or BPA mein hume do angles so pata hai already 90 or 30. Third angle hum find kar lenge ye wala. Or angle ka naam kya hai? BAP. So what I can you do is I can take triangle BPA and in it you can see that one angle is 30, other is 90 and the third one, third one is PAB. It is equal to 180, angle in a semicircle. So aapko angle kya mil jayega? Angle PAB, it will be 180 minus 120 equals 60 degree. PAB ki value aagi aapki 60 degree. Next triangle हम लेंगे OPA, triangle OPA. OPA में find करने की कोशिश करते हैं या APO लिख लेते हैं इसको. One of the same thing, you can write anything. और यहाँ पे अगर आप ध्यान से देखो, तो आपके पास एक radius है circle का OP और OA. और अगर ये दोनों equal हैं, OP और OA equal हैं, तो इसका मतलब क्या हुआ? Which type of triangle this is? It is a equilateral triangle. और equilateral triangle है तो उसका base angles कैसे होंगे equal होंगे तो अगर ये 60 है this will be 60 as well let me use the other pen this one will be 60 as well if this is 60 this will be 60 so I can write that my angle OPA is equal to angle OAP और OAP की value कितनी है हमारी it is 60 ठीक है। Now what I can find is APT. APT find कर सकते हैं क्योंकि ये 60 है, बचा हुआ part कितना होगा? 30. This one I am marking it again with a an pen pen. So this one will be 30 degree. Because this, if this is 60, total is 90. So rest of the part will be 90 minus 60. That is 30 degree. So angle APT find करना है ना आपको? Angle APT will be equal to 90. Minus 60, it will give you 30 degree. Now, what we can find is we can find the angle PAT. PAT is easy to find because we have this angle known. This is 60. So, what is the angle? It will be 180 minus 60. So, what is the angle PAT? It will be 180 minus 60. It will give you 120 as an angle. और इसको क्या लिखोगे? Linear pair. और linear pair से आपका angle PAT भी आ गया. अब PAT नहीं find करना था, हमें कौन सा angle find करना था? PTA. तो बस angle sum property use करो यहाँ पे. और आपका third angle आ जाएगा. So you can do this yourself. And it will be 120 plus, plus 30. And subtracted from 180. So 30 is the answer. PTA will be. 30 degree and yes this is the answer for the seventh one now starting with the eighth one 